morning, YouTube. Hey, what's up? I just wanted to talk to you guys a little bit about what eating one meal a day has done for me. So, in the beginning, at first, uh, I was a little skeptical about it. <clears throat> but I actually follow Mike Rashid, and Mike Rashid was going on about how he eats one meal a day. Uh, he was doing it. He had to be doing this for about a year now, and um, he was he was really he wasn't saying like you can do it or you should do it or he was just saying if you want to do it you can. So I started researching it. I started looking into intermittent fasting, and um, you know uh, I was eating about six meals a day. You know what you're supposed to eat when you're trying to slim down or at least what I thought and of course there's different methods to it there's different nutrition plans so you could you know cut out carbs and then eat um, nothing but meats and vegetables and fruits you know you can uh, you can eat a, a paleo diet as some people do do and then you can you can reach ketosis which is um, something that I was trying to do at the time. Um, and let's see, I worked out um, consistently. I went from three days a week to six days a week to seven days a week. Um, and I was big. I was about 263 pounds. Um, and after about, I want to say a year, a year, I had lost about 10 pounds, 253. So I lost 10 pounds and um, and I'm eating healthy, but I'm not, I'm, I'm having my cheat day on Sundays and then going back to eating healthy and not really a cheat day because it was really more like a cheat meal, right? But I was big, I was bigger. Um, I was still, I still had the stomach and I, I still have the stomach now a little bit, but I, I had a bulging out stomach, like a big gut and I felt heavy and, um, it definitely felt, you know, my body weight and I wasn't where I wanted to be. Even though my muscles started to get toned, my chest started to get toned. Um, I started seeing differences in that area. I was still very bulky and that wasn't the look I was looking for. And some people, that's the look they're looking for. So, when I did this, uh, I decided, after watching one of Mike Rashid's videos, to research Omad or one meal a day, right? So I'm like, all right, I'm gonna research this. I'm gonna look it up. So I did a lot of research on it, from watching YouTube videos, the good, the bad, the ugly, to researching it online, to researching intermittent fasting, to following, of course, my dude that supports IF Warriors. I love that dude. Um, by the way, you know, shout outs to him. Shout outs to Mike Rasheed, because I absolutely love Mike Rasheed. Everything he's ever told us or ever done, like it's, it's staying consistent and it's really dope. Um, so Mike Rasheed definitely changed my, my life. Uh, Simeon Panda as well. Um, I really love those guys. They're bodybuilders. They're dope. Um, Mike Rashid's a businessman. I'm an entrepreneur. Uh, so it's pretty dope that he comes out and and gives us advice. And uh, most times I take his advice. Uh, there's not really anything I disagree with because everybody has their different methods. Simeon Panda has his eating methods and different methods that he does. But it's consistent. I understand that when you're looking for your body, you have to learn patience. But you have to understand that's going to take a couple years to get where you want to get. If you want to get to those big, shredded, nice-looking body, it takes constant work. All right? But I wasn't looking for the bulky thing. I was looking for more like a lean, lean look, you know, um, actually. And so when I found, um, found out so much about one meal a day, I decided after a year of consistently working out, after a year of consistently doing things, I was just like, all right, I'm going to do it. Because I increased my cardio. I did that constantly. Cardio, on cardio, I was burning about a thousand pounds. I mean, not a thousand pounds. <laughs> I was burning about a thousand 
calories on cardio. So when I did that, um, you know, I thought I was going to see more results, but I wasn't seeing the results I wanted. And I wasn't burning the fat I wanted. My, my And I needed to get lower. I, I have high blood pressure, um, just problems overall with my weight, feeling heavy, you know, out of breath and stuff like that. So I was like, nah, this is just too big. I feel too heavy. I'm walking too heavy. So I decided to try intermittent fasting and I went strictly cold turkey straight one meal a day. The first week was the hardest in the world. I have never just on purpose ate one meal a day. But to tell you the truth, I had amazing results and I'm going to show you guys right here. And where that, those, like how you see in the picture, the three stacked up, how I went from 253, 243, to 233, and now I'm 222. It has shredded body fat, strictly body fat. I did not lose my muscle at all, at all. I consistently, I could work out in the gym. And it's, it's, it's a learning, it's a learning process. So at first, it's like one meal a day, I could eat whatever I want now. And I, I had been doing that, I eat whatever I want. I still mostly ate healthy, but like if I wanted like cheesecake or something like that, I was eating that too. And I was still burning fat. Um, but after a while, I'm at 222. And I'm like, man, I'm, I'm at 222 for a month. I'm not seeing results, you know, I'm not seeing no more results, no more fat being burnt. Um, so it's definitely has been a learning process for me. There's certain things you can't do when you eat one meal a day. Like some people do snacks and I think that's cool. Um, I don't personally, I just drink water all day until it's time for me to eat my meal. Some people work out before eating the meal. Some people work out after. I've seen better results working out before the meal on the fastest state because that's when you burn your, your fat even better. So I would definitely say that um, one meal a day has helped me. I've seen consistent results. In 60 days, I lost 20, 20 pounds. In 80 days, I lost 30 pounds. And then now I'm sitting at 42 pounds down. One meal a day has literally changed my life. I feel more focused. I can concentrate more. I... Um, I actually feel healthier. My blood pressure has went down. Um, my body adapted to it, and it will adapt to it. And if I ever feel like super hungry, I might drink a tea, um, no sugar in it. So it was meant to lower insulin levels, and that's where I was messing up originally. So now I'm doing this crazy 30-day hardcore strict transformation i'm been i've been stuck at 222 because i've been eating pies with my one meal i've been i've been eating a lot but you can't really eat your daily value in one sitting but if you're eating junk food you are what you eat you see things you see uh you see pimples grow you see um you know acne you feel terrible the next day your body doesn't hold on to it your body wants to hold on to those sugars so your gut may be out you don't want that you want to eat right so i was listening to mike Rasheed, and so i decided that i'm gonna do all plant-based and do a pescatarian diet for the next 30 days and see how it helps me